While many nursing homes couldn't allow people in after the state approved visitors last week, now we're hearing from one woman who got to see her father once, but then was cut off once again. She didn't want to reveal the name of that nursing home, but did tell Christian Garzon her story. Tammy O'Brien says the visit with her dad in a nursing home last week, the first in months, was perfect. Well, as perfect as it could be in the age of COVID-19. Well, rules, everything was great. I mean, they, um, you go in, you're masked, obviously. They take your temperature. What did you guys talk about? Oh, everything. Baseball, Yankees, everything. But then a shift in strategy. Visitations were cut off, and she's not alone. O'Brien says the sudden announcement by Governor Cuomo on allowing visitations might have left a number of homes scrambling to make preparations, only to find out they weren't fully ready. I've heard there's a lot of paperwork involved, and New York State changed their requests for their opening plans, so I, I don't know. And the new requirements to allow visitations, lengthy, extra PPE, distance, added sanitation, and quarantine times are just a start. Her father, who has dementia, is again confused as to why he can't see his daughter face to face. I yeah. talk with him daily, yeah. like five, six times a day. He doesn't understand. O'Brien says there could be a number of things at play here. For an example, one positive COVID case could mean a stop to visits for 28 days. But O'Brien doesn't know. She just wants clear communication and for Albany to review the overall nursing home situation. Reporting for News 8, this is Christian Garzone.